Hi guys. So the time has come, the time, the time is near. My final deadlines for uni are two weeks today. And you know what that means. It's the time of year of my vlog of, I did, in first year I did, will I finish first year or will first year finish me? In second year I did, will I finish second year or will second year finish me? This year it's, will I finish my degree or will my degree finish me? At this point, I'm questioning it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to document the last two weeks of my degree and then I'm done. I could literally cry. Um, it's been an emotional roller coaster, an emotional three years, but it's nearly over. If any of you have watched from my fucking pre-uni vlogs, my uni shopping, this feels very full circle. If you have been here since I started my degree, let me know. Let me know in the comments. Say hi. I want to know. But um, yeah, let me show you my work so far. So these are some pictures of my final collection. I don't know how well you can see this, but this is some for my photo shoot. Here's another one. These are my garments. And then these are two pages of my portfolio. This is the first page. My my major fashion project is called Old Me, New Me. And then the little thing, a love letter to my teenage self and the woman she has become. And then, yeah, these are the pages. Um, I currently have about six portfolio pages done. A lot more to do. But I'm going to try and do some now. But I just thought I'd start the vlog now, two weeks in advance. Done my photo shoot. Some of my garments are currently in London because I won a competition for the talent of tomorrow so I had to take my garments to London to be a part of the photo shoot for graduate fashion week which is really fun and slay go me amazing stuff from me but um yeah this is the current sitch I'll update you maybe by the end of the weekend I don't know I don't know I should have vlogged my photo shoot so stupid of me to not because it was a really fun day but yeah anyway check in with you soon so it's friday the 3rd of may deadlines in a week a week today and i've basically finished my portfolio nearly finished my lookbook um yeah guys when i tell you i've not slept this badly in so long i've been going to sleep at like two every night and waking up at like seven and then going back to sleep till like eight and that is the vibe. I've been drinking caffeine. I don't drink caffeine because I have crippling anxiety. I've been drinking caffeine because it's been, I've literally been like, I have to do my work, like, and I need to stay awake. It's been fucking real. But um, I'm going into uni now, so. Maybe I'll try and vlog at uni. So I'm at uni guys, it's the end of the day. It's like four o'clock. I don't know what's going on with my headphones, just rolled across the table. I've sent my lookbook to get printed because I finished that today. I have finished my portfolio, I just need to add, bless me. I actually don't even know if there's anything I need to add. I just need to put it all into the document so that on first thing Tuesday morning, I can take it to this print place and get it printed. And then I need to bind it on, if I get it back on like, Wednesday then I can bind it on Wednesday add any like physical things to it I'll show you my portfolio and my lookbook oh let me I'll show it to you when I'm can I show it to you now I'll show it to you when I'm home printed off like a draft version of my lookbook just on the printer I only show you when I'm home so team little update for you all I think actually last time I spoke to you I said I'd show you my mock-up of my lookbook so let me show you that also please excuse how I'm filming interviews tomorrow so I want to look nice, so I want my hair to have a bit of something. But um, it's currently the 7th of May, it's a Tuesday. I went to this printing place in town today to get my portfolio printed. That's ready to pick up tomorrow. Uh, my lookbooks are ready to pick up tomorrow. Um, I just need to finish my presentation, finish my sketchbook, organise my tech file and my samples folder. Then I'm finito, then I'm done. But yeah, let me show you my mock-up. So this is the cover, the light is shining on Kane's face. This is the cover. And then inside is this page, this page, and then this page, this page, this page, this page, and this. Um, yeah. Also, that graffiti was already on the wall. I didn't do that. 
I know that's you can't see it very well but in the next clip I'll probably be showing you the actual real thing so don't panic but um yeah I officially have Wednesday Thursday Friday three days left of my degree honestly guys I think I said this at the start of the video but I started filming this the other day if you've been here since when I started uni please comment below and let me know when you started watching me and if you have were here before I came to uni and when I came to uni because I think that's super cute but yeah it's like nearly 10 o'clock I'm probably going to read some of my book. Started reading this book yesterday. No one ever has sex on Tuesday. Got it from the charity shop. Um, gonna carry on reading that. Drink my green tea. I've taken my magnesium. It's my nighttime routine. And then I'll update in the morning. I think I'm doing interviews all morning. I need to go and pick up my lookbook. My baby hairs are going cray cray at the moment. Um, need to pick up my lookbook from the print studio do interviews and then at the end of the day I need to go and print pick up my portfolio from town and then I'll show you that it's all so exciting and so scary guys my degree is nearly finished and I'm feeling mentally quite okay right now but stay tuned so it's Thursday today my portfolio is printed I will show it to you later when I bind it and stuff but like a little snippet for you um, yeah, I need to carry that into uni somehow. I had to carry it back from town yesterday and I was literally like... But, um, I've got my presentation today, suited and booted. I'm not even feeling particularly nervous right now, although I did have a really stressful dream about it last night where one of my sister's best friends, Bridie, was also doing the presentation. No idea why. Bridie isn't a fashion student. Bridie lives in Australia with my sister, but... Yeah, it was really weird and Bridie did like really well on it and she was before me and then like hers was so different to mine that I was like, fuck, I'm going to do so bad. And then my sister and like a load of her friends and one of her friend's boyfriends, like her friends from like school, um, were in like an accident and I was having, it was just, I can't even be asked to explain it, it was all very stressful and I woke up very stressed. But mellowing myself back down, I'm going to drop my phone. But um, yeah, I've got my presentation this morning and this afternoon I need to cover my portfolio covers with denim because I want it covered in denim, I think. And then, and then I need to print out a load of stuff for my sketchbook. If I have time today, I'm going to organise, organise my technical file and my samples folder. But if I don't have time today, I'll just do it tomorrow. I'm going to finish my sketchbook tonight. It's all big things happening today. <clears throat> So I'll update you when I'm at uni, probably after my presentation. So I'm at uni now, I'm just filling up my water. My presentation is next, Hannah's in there right now. Um, and I'm kind of scared, but I also feel quite chill about it, which is also good. So I'll update you afterwards. So I did my presentation and I stayed it and my teachers were saying really nice things. I'm gonna give it the window because the lighting's nice. And yeah, I feel amazing guys. I'm just, finishing my portfolio now we're gonna go for lunch i'm finishing like binding it i'll show you it after we come back from lunch but um all in all a sleigh day all i've got now is to like submit everything tomorrow like physically hand in this is so exciting so this is my portfolio i've got my cover page with my name on it and i have my designer statement and my contents page and then oh, i'm gonna burp hold on <coughs> bless me after that, then I've got my initial research pages slash, like, my... Well, that's just my initial research and, like, my project pages, whatever the fuck they're called. Then I have my more research pages. And then after that, we go into colour and fabric. This is all my colour research, inspir my colour inspiration, and my fabric and my Pantones. And then this is my first design development page. So I've got, like, my draping on the stands, my initial drawings. Then you go into my design development of like my twirling and stuff like that. Then you go into the design development, oh my god, I literally can't speak, of my making. And then after that, it comes to my lineup and my range plan. After that, you've got the photo pages from my shoot. And then after that, you've got my competition that I did before Christmas. I did like an Is Isabella Varana X Depop, like upcycling thing. So I've got my research, and then my lineup and my range plan and then done and then I've got the tech packs and they're so fucking boring I'm literally not even gonna bore you guys with that and yeah that is my portfolio so it is Friday morning team it's my last day of uni I'm gonna get really sad 
this is my outfit. I put this t-shirt on because it's what I wore on the first day of uni and it just felt right to honour myself that way. I'm so weird with things like that. Like in my driving test, I wore the t-shirt that I wore. Both my driving tests, I wore the t-shirt I wore that in my first driving lesson. But anyway, I'm feeling sad. My degree is coming to close. This chapter of my life is closing, which just makes me feel really emotional. But you know, I've had an amazing time. I still need to finish my sketchbook. I've literally dumped everything in this box. I'm just going to take this box to uni with me um, to finish that off. And I, because I have a few more bits, I need to print that I forgot. So I'm stupid. I need to submit my portfolio. I submitted my self assessment sheet last night and I submitted my Viber presentation. So you submit portfolio, do this, sort out my tech file. And then my last submission of my undergraduate degree is done. And you won't find me doing a postgraduate degree, so this is it for me. But yeah, it's actually making me want to cry. I feel like I need to play like the song that we play in like Leavers Assembly. Like if anyone that watched this like went to Goldville School, my primary school, um, know the Leavers song, super emo. I feel like I need to listen to that. But I <laughs> I literally got tears in my eyes. I'm so proud of myself. Oh what a life, eh? Why am I literally crying? First of many tears today, I fear. Anyway, I'm gonna go finish getting ready and then I'm off to uni. So, we just submitted. I literally have a random box of shit. We are done. We have finished our degree. We finished our degree. This is so serious. Um, that shit's gonna blow away that I'm holding. Um, yeah, it feels very emotional. Very, very bittersweet. Mm. It is, but we're so proud of ourselves army pap yeah yeah and we've worked so hard and we just deserve to go out and get really fucking drunk so that's exactly what we're gonna do um yeah this has been an emotional roller coaster guys so glad to share it with you um i hope that you have oh this is a bit loud i hope that you have enjoyed sharing my uni experience with me it's literally been amazing and there are still more things to come we've got the fashion show we've got graduate fashion week we've got the degree show so we will be back and i also work at uni so i will be back but um yeah i hope you've really enjoyed this journey with me i just said that but yeah oh my god it's rosa well i'm gonna end the vlog here but i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next time <laughs> bye <laughs>